All right, here is a quick, unfortunate, bad, lousy, crappy update on the Let's Make a Williams Mini. Um, the silver laid out great. So the silver paint is on. I use the Rust-Oleum aluminum oil-based paint. Comes in quartz, you can get it at Home Depot. And that laid out fine. Nice, smooth surface, okay? You now you come down here, it's nice and smooth. You can even see any reflections in it and whatnot. Um, but the problem lies with the stencil. What happened with the stencil, and this is by far is the nicest edge I ever got, it didn't, the paint didn't want to stick. Look right here, this whole corner did not stick. Didn't want to stick to it. I don't know why. I don't know if I waited too long or waited too little, but it just did not want to adhere when I removed the stencil. And I was even fighting the stencil the entire time when I was removing the mask off of it. Um, it just, it didn't want to stay on here. Um, I don't know if it's because maybe I didn't wait long enough. I mean, I waited several days before I touched, started to do the stencil. I wanted this thing to air out. It, it didn't like me. It did not like me one little bit. I mean, even removing the mask. Now this is what, <laughs> right here, fit of rage. I was like, you know what, at this point, screw it. I'm probably gonna have to strip the entire cabinet anyway. But yeah, it, you know, marred that up. It's just not good. So, I mean, the paint just, it's just chipping. I mean, I can pull, I'm pulling this off right now with my fingers. See that? It did not stick. I don't know what's going on. But anyway, so that's that bad news. And by the way, this is the, the red that I used on top. It just, you know, I thought this would have adhered better. And it didn't. Didn't adhere very well at all. I've actually got an email out to Rustolium and another email out to Game Stencil. See if I can buy another half cent stencil set. Um, I just need the red layer. And then on the original, the this planking, this does not look good. Um, it, it's not looking good at all. I don't like it. Um, and then uh, one of the previous people who had this cabinet did some body work on it. And it all showed up. I think the reasoning behind this is that they didn't sand it down enough. It all showed up. This is horrible. I, I mean, I, I'm not letting this leave the garage looking like this. So when I got this cabinet, as you guys saw, it was already primed and ready to go. So that's, I just put paint on and this is what happened. So today you get to share in my misery <laughs> of huge setbacks, huge setbacks. So we have a setback here and a setback here. It's like we're starting all over again. <sighs> As always, guys, thank you for watching. And if you have any insight, please feel free to share as well as sharing in my misery. <laughs> All right. Thanks a lot, guys, and take it easy.